Hello, hello, welcome to the stream. How's your calculation training? We solve these puzzles to improve our calculation and visualization skills. And we hopefully can apply this in our own games to win. Some with some beautiful combinations. So why to move? It's the first one. So Probably there are no good quintex b7 or quintex g6, those are the checks, probably not good. The captures quintex e5, probably that's also not good. So maybe this is something else. Maybe this is not about capturing in the beginning. Attacking with something like b4 can be also. Keep in mind. What else? Oh, yeah, if you are interested about coaching, send me an email about Attila Turzo at gmail.com or you can send me a message also on whatever platform do you prefer on YouTube. You can leave a comment. Okay, chess.com, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook. So, so, we have a strong pawn on d6, that's good, yeah, yeah, b4 is a strong attacking move, b4, what if he plays b6, then we play bishop d4, yeah, and if bishop takes b4, then we take the knight and then take the bishop, okay, <coughs> so b4, b4, b6 is not possible, only bishop d8 is possible after b4, B4, bishop d8, what's next? Queen takes e5, he captures back. No check. Yeah, that's the unprotected piece, the a5. Queen, maybe something like queen a4. Still, queen bishop d8. Hmm. Hmm.
Hmm. Wow, what to do? Wow. It looks like it start to be harder and harder. Maybe rook takes f6. I like actually rook takes f6. Rook takes f6, king takes f6, queen f4 check. King should go to g7, then queen takes e5 check. Okay, that, that looks actually good. Because if king g8, then bishop e6, and that's going to be a checkmate. If uh, king h6, then bishop e3 check, that will be also a checkmate. Okay, so rook takes f6 looks good. Rook takes f6. Yeah, he's not forced to take. If he defends, he can defend it. The queen e8. Then rook e6. Okay. Okay, this is it. Okay, let's go. go back. So rook takes f6. Rook takes f6. Removing the defender. Removing the defender. Okay, take, check, moves, check, check, mate. what if he moves to here, then we get with the bishop, and the checkmate comes this way. Okay, that's it. Yeah, of course you can move the knight back, back to c6, that's the best. We will not go deep in deep in that, how to play there. We want the, we want the pawn, that's the most important. And still attacking. Okay, let's go for the next one. Why to move again? Okay, so let's think about what's next. What's next?
So we need to check if there is any important checks or captures. Okay, bishop takes g7, rook takes g7, queen takes g7, rook takes g7, so probably that's not a capture. So attacking with d7 looks like a strong one. If queen takes, then bishop d6 check, king s7, queen g6 checkmate. If the bishop takes, then also bishop d6 check, king e8, queen g6, king d8. Rook b8 check, bishop c8, hmm, and there is no more checks, okay, but that, that looks good actually, that looks good, okay, no, d7, bishop takes a rook b8 check first, so forcing back the bishop, or winning the rook. I'll give him the check now, okay, that's also, also a possibility, yeah, to give the check now. Which I think both possible, rook b8 now, immediately. Let me just check also with the engine. Yeah, rook b8 is also an option. That's also fine. Yeah, we just take it. We have king f7, that's a nice checkmate. Well, it is another nice checkmate. Yeah, king d8 is a better move. Yeah, this is good. Okay, let's go for the next one, which is why to move again. Yeah, I would like to show my gratitude and say thank you again for the Kayo who actually gifted 100 subs. <laughs> wow, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you all others also the support if you are subscribing to the channel or sending donations or gifting subs or just follow the channel or just watch it so all the support is appreciated yeah thank thank you very much yeah, actually if you want to solve these kind of puzzles or the old puzzles which i did in the last 40 days this is actually the 40th day i am doing everyday puzzles like this one hour you can just check my blog i sent in the link which is like on chess.com slash blog slash Attila tour so that's my blog where you can check all the previous puzzles and solve them actually watch them on video or on maybe like 20 30 person them or so you can just solve from the from the blog site So 
So why to what to do here? The king looks kind of like in trouble for a bit. Yeah, the AA truck is hanging. The knight and the bishop and the queen is looking for the black king. Okay, I think we just knight f6 check, need to take it. Then we take the his knight to make sure it will not interfere. The king queen takes the bishop takes its seven check. We need to take it, then we we'll give a check on h5, and then give a check on g4, and then rook comes to e3, and we checkmate him. Ah, okay, this is also possible actually. Wow. We cannot play f5 because we're losing the queen. We win the queen or... We're giving the checkmate. Let me check again about my solution too because I think it's probably again... There's more than one good way to go. Yeah, this is clearly the best, but the capture it looks also good. If capture it, then that comes what I said, like... Checkmate. Yeah, if he's not taking that, the more challenging one. Let's run away, then we give a checkmate. Wow, look what a nice checkmate the rook. If you move something else, then Queen G5 checkmate is there. If you capture us, then Queen H6 checkmate. Ha! <laughs> wow, probably I need to save these checkmates for future investigation. <laughs> To check, check, and the check rate. So, yeah, I like these also, these nice checkmates. Maybe even this looks like more direct to win, win the queen. But I like those other checkmates too. Okay, let's go for the next one. So, white, white to move.
Hmm. So what should I do here? What should I do? Look for the checks, captures, attacking moves.
Yeah, thank you very much for joining us. Hmm. So, rook takes c8 maybe? Knight c6 check looks also reasonable. Yeah, mini bit stream. Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you. Looks like white already sacrificed a piece, so... Huh. The rook, the d6 rook is unprotected, the f6 bishop is unprotected. The moment has unprotected pieces are signed for a combination. What should we do?
Queen B4. Something I really missing it here. Uh, okay, maybe we need to sacrifice on B7, and the rook C7, and then Queen A4. So we should try to go for the checkmate somehow. Can I take B7? It's how it's not that much f forcing. He can move the rook maybe to B6. The knight c6 check. Pawn takes, pawn takes. King a8, c7 double check and a queen. Queen b8 check mate. Wow, that's something nice. But knight c6 you can take with the knight. Then we take with the pawn. Then you can play b6. B6, then we play C7 checkmate. Okay, so that's. cannot take it. Maybe not C6. Okay, so let me just calculate that. Because knight takes pound takes and he's not forced to take it. He can all oh, the capturing will be seven and then we should be seven. Okay, so knight c6, pawn takes, pawn takes, king to c7, try to avoid the checkmate. Then queen b8 check. If captures, then c7 checkmate. If he plays king d8, then Queen takes d6 check. Bishop d7. c7 checking c8, queen a6 checkmate. That's it. Yeah, okay, but it's the very beginning, I think. Yeah, he should not take it, that's the first thing. Yeah, and, but this is just very, very high-intensity game. Hello, Dr. Osip, nice to see you here. Wow, thank you for joining us. We have a lot of viewers now, 1,000 viewers. So we are doing calculation exercises. No, some easier, some harder, more most of the time harder, actually harder puzzles to increase our visualization and calculation skills and be able to spot those tactics which mean which will win us the game. Hello Ashmeg, nice to see you. Emilius, thank you very much for the follow. Actually, I am from Hungary. Yeah, if you are new to the stream, I am Attila Turzo, an international master and chess coach. I started to play chess when I was around six, seven years old, and soon played in 
competitions with kids and I had like twice a week two hours of group coaching one the first hour we had like a lesson and then the second hour we played five minutes blitz games um, I became an international master at the age of 18 and Hungarian junior champion at the age of 19 and actually when I finished secondary school in the when I was 18 years old I started to coach in the last 23 years old 23 years no 25 years now I was teaching students from all around the world and from 2001 I started to teach online like 20 years ago I was one of the first online chess teachers so I have big experience I am teaching from very beginner level from the age of 14 there is no limit for older people I, I, I was teaching also a player who are over 70 and I also I was teaching masters my best student became actually a grandmaster one of the best hundred players of the world rated over 2600 national champion of Paraguay but my usual student is a hobby player who likes to play online or likes to play over the board and would like to have more fun, improve, need some guidance or want to spend a chess hour with a friend who helps him. Yeah, if you are one of, one of those players who would like to study with me, you can just send me a message. You can email me also like my email address is Attila turzo at gmail.com or you can send me a message on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, chess.com or any other plat preferred plat link add in. Yeah. Okay, so probably this would be the best for black to play and here at this position is probably more likely this will be equal. It's everything changed and then it's just a equal game. But if the pawn captures this would be nice, you know, capturing and if it captures then it's checkmate on C7. King D and then this check comes. Another checkmate. Let's look what if the queen moves here. Check, check, we shall see through. Oh, this is a beautiful check, it is a discovered that attack. But the bishop gives the checkmate. Okay, let's move on and solve a few more puzzles. So why to move again? Yeah, I am vegan, yeah. Are you also vegan <laughs> or how did you get this idea? Yeah, I prefer plant-based food, yeah, in the last uh, how many years? Mm. 17 years, yeah, I was eating only plant-based food. Yeah, I think this is good for the... for everybody. <laughs> Actually, good for the animals, also good for the nature, for planet Earth, so it's easier to grow planets than animals. Or in the same land you can create food for more people if, if they are eating plants. Also good for the climate and also good for the soul. So I think, yeah, this is a win-win situation for everybody.
But of course, this is a process. I was first uh, eating everything like normal people or everybody else. Then I was started to be vegetarian when I was 19 years old, and then later I became vegan. But I accept if somebody eats differently, of course. It's a very private decision. So why to move? What should I do here? <laughs> so why to move? So probably root text e7 looks like a very direct attacking move. Maybe root, root text e7, knight text e7, maybe queen takes d7. Ah, this is I think one of the classical games. So root text e7, knight takes e7, queen takes d7. King takes d7, then bishop. Uh, whatever, both or both looks good. Bishop b5, or bishop f5 check, double check. Then king goes to e8, then bishop e7 check, king goes to f8, then bishop takes e7 checkmate. Let's make it slower, so sacrificing the rook to opening up the diagonal for the queen, then sacrificing the queen to gain time. Check comes. The king goes to c6. Then come this checkmate. Goes there, then check, and then checkmate. Question if this was. Ah, no, bishop b5 is not working because king e6 and then king, king takes f6, so bishop f5 is the only way. Wow, beautiful. Let's go for the next one. White to move. <laughs> white to white to move. Hmm. What can you do? What can you do? Yeah, look all the checks, captures, other stuff.
So sacrificing one g6 looks like a good idea. Rook takes g6, if bishop takes g6, then queen takes e6 check. Bishop f7, then we go back to f6, and then queen g7 is undefendable. If the pawn takes on g6, then we should go, I think, to 7 check, king takes 8 7. Queen takes f7 check. If knight g7, then we do king, king g2, and then rook h1 is coming. If king f8, rook h1, knight h5, then bishop f6, checkmate. Okay, king g, probably king g2 is the same, good. Tries to run away, then it's check. Checkmate, it's nice. If you go to the other direction, The other checkmate. Yeah, I'm your flight. Thank you, thank you very much for the food. Thank you. So let's go for the next one. White to move. This will be the, will be the last one for this session. So white to move. Hmm. Let's maybe look. Yeah, rook g4 looks the most direct way to go. Rook g4, queen takes f5. Should take probably the other way, we just take the queen or take on g7, and then rook takes g7, check, king h8, rook takes f7, check, king g8, rook g7, check again, king h8, ah. okay, so maybe that's not that clear. Rook g5, then f6. Yeah, we can take the queen, but that's. Ah, no! So we do. Okay. So check. Okay, I think what we will do. So rook takes g7, check. King f8, rook takes f7, check. King g8, rook g7, check. King g8. I think to take the check, actually. The b7 but then he just plays rook f6 so there is maybe some some trick here yeah we need to exchange yeah so rook g4, queen takes f5, rook takes g7, check, king h6, rook takes f7, check, king g8, 
rook g7 check king h8 and then rook g6 check rook f6 forced then bishop takes f6 queen takes f6 forward rook takes f6 and up the exchange yeah so check check it's forced to what if what if queen f6 here just a question I will take it to the check oh that's nice so we are up a rook okay so that's not good check check and now rook f6 is only move or queen f6 but the same will be then winning material and now the rook against the bishop will win the game wow nice okay so thank you thank you everybody for the support actually thank you again Dikayo who gifted 100 subs today thank you for the support yeah dear viewers if you can please support the stream by subscribing you can use this link or you can also send donations or you can follow the channel or share the link which I am sending out when I I start streaming so thank you all, all the support love you all hopefully you will be able to use these ideas in your own games and please send me a message if you want a nice game by using any of these ideas Yeah, and if you would like to improve your chess, we can meet every day here. I do every day at least one hour of tactics training. Yeah.